Welcome to WatchGuard's Daily Security Byte. I'm Corey Nockreiner. Tuesday's story is a new zero-day Adobe flash flaw being exploited in the wild. Today, Adobe released an out-of-cycle security update to fix a zero-day flaw in Flash. It's called CVE 2015-3113. And this is a flaw that a bad guy can leverage to uh, automatically download and install malicious code on your computer simply by getting you to go to a website. Apparently, this particular exploit works against Internet Explorer running on Windows 7 or or Firefox running on Windows XP. As it turned out, a security company called FireEye actually found this vulnerability spreading in the wild. One of the APT groups they follow, called APT3, is a group of alleged Chinese actors that are targeting the intellectual property of high-tech companies, telecommunication, defense, and other sorts of uh, a big industry to steal very important documents. Apparently, this attack will come in an uh, email. In fact, it actually looks like like a traditional spam email, not your more targeted spear phishing email. Apparently the email tries to entice you by getting rebates or discounts on Apple certified devices. And there's a link in the email. So if you click on this malicious link, it brings you to a website. Uh, once it checks your computer, it will exploit this flash flaw to install one of the back doors that's used by this APT3 group. So what can you do about this? Well, first of all, if you use Adobe Flash in your organization, get all your clients to update as soon as possible. On top of that, you might want to consider the use of Flash in your network. More and more websites out there are going away from Flash and going to HTML5. So if you can avoid using Flash in your network, that might help you. Uh, one thing you can do on a WatchGuard Firebox or XTM appliance is block SWF or FLV content, which is the actual file types that Flash delivers media as. Another thing, by the way, I've looked at some of FireEye's indicators of compromise, and the actual malicious files that are used by this APT3 group are actually blocked by our antivirus company, AVG. Anyways, moral of the story is update Flash, and if you can, avoid using it in your network. That's it for today. Thank you for watching.